Here it is, folks, my tribute to Rats Off To Ya from Tom Goes to the Mayor, which aired on Adult Swim on December 19, 2004. My experience with Tom Goes to the Mayor goes back to when I was 13 years old and visiting some of my maternal relatives in San Francisco. And I was immediately taken aback by the limited animation of the show, which involved photographs of real life people, let alone the real life actors portraying these characters and then having all of these facial expressions, which I found absolutely interesting and absolutely intriguing to the point where my eyes were quite glued to the screen because of how innovative and just how awesome it really looked. For something that seemed rather limited and low budget, it managed to leave me glued to the screen. And the first episode I remembered watching was Rats Off To Ya, the Christmas special. And now as an adult, I can fully appreciate this episode and also the whole show on a much deeper level because of just how witty, clever, and absolutely biting it can be, especially when you have the likes of Tim Heidecke and Eric Warrenheim on the helm, who also created this show, as well as their hit show, Tim and Eric, awesome show, great job. And this was how I managed to get myself introduced to Tim and Eric's style of comedy, which is satirical, biting, and absolutely clever. And it was just through this show that I managed to not only enjoy their style of comedy, but also managed to be completely immersed in terms of how Tom finds himself in all of these mishaps in the town of Jefferson. And what's so fascinating about this Christmas special is the many interludes that happen. This Christmas special opens with the hand of Tim Heidecker opening a book and we hear a chorus introduce Tom and his willingness to start his own business with a shirt design he has made on his own. And from there, I started to get a great impression on who the characters are. Tom, while mild-mannered and sweet on the outside, doesn't really have a lot of backbone, and he does have the tendency to be gullible, while the mayor, even though he has a position of power, is really puerile, especially on how he treats Tom and his shirt design. Especially when the mayor boisterously laughs the whole idea of it off, though he thinks it would make for a really great idea. Sure, Tom gets the ghost signal from the mayor, even though he even though he is quite new at selling his shirts at the mall, until he meets Pat Carici, who is the manager of Jester's. And I could really tell that Pat Carici was not really going to be great news with his blustery attitude and just how insincere he is. I could definitely tell that guy spelled trouble, especially when he was sneaking on Tom's novelty idea of his shirt. The kicker is, once Pat Carici dupes Tom into leaving his post, he ends up stealing his idea. And with poor Tom trying desperately to reclaim his idea, with the mayor not really doing anything about it and worsening his problem. And the episode doesn't really end too happily for Tom, as the Rats Off Tia craze is still being perpetuated even during the nativity scene, with the mayor dancing in a rat costume and the episode ending with Tom shedding a tear saying that this is what Christmas is all about even though we know that he kind of got screwed over from that particular moment. So yes, this whole holiday episode may be a downer but I could still manage to appreciate it because of how dry, witty, and just how satirical it all is is, especially when it comes to the whole traps of capitalism and, of course, dirty business practices as what Pat Carici did to Tom. When it comes to Tom, I do feel pretty sorry for him, but at the same time, I can't help but tell him to have a lot more backbone and really fight for what's his. And that downer ending really does show how sorry I feel for Tom, with his idea being stolen, the mayor not doing anything to help him, and the people around him just being awful. Nevertheless, this Christmas special still wins my eyes for how biting, satirical, 
and just how dry and witty it all is. And I seriously have to credit Tim Heidecker and Eric Warrenheim for doing such an amazing job making this cult classic of a show come to life. The limited animation of this show makes it quite intriguing in its own special way and adds a certain charm to it backed up by some really tight writing. And that's why I really love Rats Off To Ya. And of course, Tom Goes To The Mayor in its entirety. And for those of you who watched Rats Off To Ya from Tom Goes To The Mayor, what'd you think of it? Was there a particular moment that you really, really liked? Whether it be the kind of downer ending or even those live action television segments? Was there a character that you really, really wanted to root for, whether it be Tom or that you wanted to hate, like the mayor or Pat Carici? Or did you feel like this was a Christmas special that was not really meant for you? Comment below and let me know. Well, that's all for now. Be sure to tune in much later for yet another Adult Swim Christmas special tribute. And that is Rebel with a Claws from Squidbillies. So until then... Merry Christmas, everybody.